GDPR by law and privacy best practices expect organizations to establish privacy by design. What that means is as a part of product and service uh, development and updates that organizations should have a person or a group responsible for evaluating the privacy impacts of a new service or a new feature before the product or service is put into production and rolled out to the public. That could include a data protection officer or uh, a chief privacy officer. Um, that could include a conversation during application development or strategic planning. But the goal is to ensure that individuals' privacy is protected upfront rather than organizations rolling out services or features that have unintended privacy risks, cause harm, and then go back and fix the product later. For example, a software development company might be looking to add new features to enhance their service to uh, employers. And uh, they decide as a benefit that they'll add uh, geolocation services to an application that employees use. And they might think it's useful for employers to know where their employees are physically located, but that has profound and significant privacy risks. And if that organization had had discussions about whether that geolocation feature was appropriate before they implemented it, uh, they might have either amended their, their product or left out the geolocation service altogether. So that's one example of a way that organizations can build privacy by design upfront um, and a way that an organization can miss privacy by design by not stopping and evaluating the privacy risks until it's too late. Thank <music> you.